All right, guys, what's up? Uh, welcome to another episode of the Stock Bros Podcast. Uh, we are available on all major podcasting platforms. Uh, before we get started, please subscribe and like the video. Uh, don't forget to leave any comments on what we can improve or what you want to hear. Also, you can use our links below for a free stock on Robinhood or use the Acorn links for a free $5 invested instantly. And uh, Tony, if you want to mention about our um, like yeah. iTunes and all that. Yeah, so we're available on all major podcast platforms. For all of you guys listening on the uh, podcasting platforms, if if you if there's anything that you hear or we say that you don't understand, we do have a YouTube channel and we do throw links up and uh, video clips or pictures, visual aids to help you under better understand what we're saying. Because sometimes some of the stuff is tech is kind of hard to understand it might be very technical so we want to help people out with visual aids but um but most of the time we yes. make them interchangeable so yeah so let's get started today we're talking about stimulus checks if you want to start us off yeah so guys we got a 600 dollars stimulus check coming for a lot of people last week this week and maybe some parts of next week uh, I know there was some hiccups with that, but uh, and most likely we're going to have another fourteen hundred to two thousand dollar stimulus. Still working out the details; we don't really know for sure, but it's it's coming, and it's a great time to take that money and start investing. And it's because yes. there's not a lot of times you're going to get an opportunity where the government's going to give you free money. So if you yep. can afford it, and uh, you know all your bills are paid, which we'll talk about in a second, then better never been a better time to get started so yeah so so let me let me start off by saying this um so there's this book called the richest man in babylon i'm gonna hold up on the screen so you guys can see it um i highly recommend reading this book if you haven't already um it basically just tells you how to be how to use your money wisely and uh how to how to go from zero dollars to being it's rich a, it's a rags um, to riches story it's the, exactly. it's the poorest man in Babylon. He becomes the richest man in Babylon. Yeah. So, so um, basically, the the main points are um, save your money, save ten percent of your money, um, control what you spend. Don't don't be stupid spending things. And and um, there's five more points. So there's seven major points in the book. But I highly recommend reading it. So that's that's the first thing I want to mention. Pay yourself first is really important when you get your stimulus check. Put ten percent into your savings. Don't take um, that money and just blow it on stupid stuff just because you got six hundred dollars save the money take ten percent that's only sixty dollars um, it's not going to kill you um, if you have student loans use some of it to pay off student loans um, don't just like I said go spend it on stupid things be smart um, the faster your loans are paid off then you don't have to worry about having monthly payments um, make sure your credit um, make sure you don't have if you have outstanding debt on your credit cards try and pay some of that off um, guys pay but, off your past yeah. due balances and exactly. keep your credit score in good health save your money control your your spending budget and pay off your debts that's pretty much why i'm going to throw up there before you start doing stupid stuff with your stimulus check and now tony if you want to yes. talk about how to invest so a lot of people have been asking us about invest what stocks to buy so if you've been watching the rest of our episodes, you know that we're big into index funds and ETFs. Well, today, I'm going to give you some stocks that you can invest in that are safe, uh, reputable, and have a lot of potential. So, number one, buying option, stick with blue chip companies. If you got your uh, $600 stimulus, $2,000 stimulus, if you invest in a company like Apple, Microsoft, Google, you're going to be doing fine. You're going to be okay in the long term. Another option is solar and renewable energy companies. Now, uh, as you know, Joe Biden's going to be the president, um, and Democrats are big into renewable renewable energy and solar. So those are stocks that are going to be up on the rise, and they up and up, I should say. Um, so some of the popular stocks that I've looked into. Um, and seriously considering myself. So Amazon, I know Amazon's really expensive. You could use fractional shares. Um, Amazon is so diversified. I mean, they're into everything, food. I mean, you name it, they do everything now. Uh, they even, I think they're even doing like a, a medical supply delivery now. 
They bought airplanes. Amazon yeah. has everything. They have Amazon Web Services. They own Whole, Whole Foods. Foods yeah. uh, um, bunch of they stuff. They just bought air, airplanes. So uh, FedEx, uh, watch out. Uh, you probably should, would short FedEx now because Amazon is going to be taking over. I really think. I mean, I mean it, it's really crazy. They have yeah. Amazon Prime. They have their own uh, version of Netflix. It's called, uh, what is oh, it yeah, called? Oh, yeah, Amazon Prime. Like, Amazon, Amazon Prime Music. Video. Yeah. Amazon Prime Video. Yeah, they have. Those, so. Yeah. So they're competing yeah. against Spotify. They're competing against Netflix by doing that. Um, right. You know, it's crazy. So you can't but... go wrong with Amazon. Another one I'm going to recommend is called Teladoc Health. Now, I've actually used this. Um, it's amazing. I, this is um, this is the future. And there's a lot of websites. Uh, I, I use, we use uh, Motley Fool. We use Market Watch. We use a lot of really reputable sources. And this is the the top one recommended everywhere. I've seen it recommended on everything. Uh, Teladoc, what it is, is if you're not familiar with it, it's a, uh, a virtual, it's like a virtual doctor appointment. So if you can't leave your house and you wanna, you wanna see a doctor, you can go online. They're 24 seven online support. They're United States licensed doctors and physicians. And one of the best stats, one of the best things about them is I look through their website. They have over 300,000 reviews with a 4.8 rating, which is insane out of five, which is insane to have 300,000 views with a 4.8 rating. You know, they're doing something right. So they have great customer service. Uh, my experience was, was great with them too. And I think this is the future because more and more people don't want to spend time getting in their cars to drive to the doctor's appointment. They don't want to take time off from work. You can literally on your lunch break, call your doctor, you know, virtually if you, if it's something minor, you know, I, I want to add something similar that we don't, we didn't put in our notes, but there's uh something called DocuSign where yes, basically yes. you're, you're signing all your, your stuff um, virtually. Yeah. I'm pretty sure. That, yeah. That's, um, yeah, that's on the up and up too. Yeah. So any virtual stuff that, like um, that's why you've seen like Amazon explode and you've seen any company that is um, based over the Internet is exploding. So it might be I think the pandemic has really shifted on um, what companies are doing and how we think of the world. Yeah, that's true. So the last one I want to recommend uh, is a comp is pharmaceutical companies. And one in particular is Vertex Pharmaceuticals. Now, this is big. Uh, I, I've done a lot of research on this one. They specialize in, <laughs> excuse me, they specialize in cystic fibrosis treatment. So if you don't know what that is, you can, you can look it up. It's a very crippling, debilitating disease. Uh, so in fact, this company predicts that it will continue to lead, be the lead player in this market for at least the next 10 years. And they're already so far ahead of everybody and they've had some incredible breakthroughs with cystic, uh, cystic fibrosis. And I think their treatments are so amazing that it's worth investing into their company. So usually we don't recommend individual stocks, like I said, but I think these, any of these stocks are going to be winners in the long term. So, yeah. Um, so yeah, I think that wraps up our episode. Just a little short you, nine minute episode. Do you want to go into, go uh, like a safe ETF if someone wants to throw all their money into one ETF. Oh yeah. Yeah. So if you, if you just want to be um, really safe with your yep. money, diversified, be um, protected against, you know, anything that goes wrong, throw it into a um, stock or an ETF called VOO. It's run by a brokerage called Vanguard, which is like the most reputable brokerage there is. And basically what it is, is it just tracks um, the S and P 500, uh, in, uh, index fund or index, sorry, the S and P 500 index, which is made up of 500 different companies. So you're going to be diversified in 500 different companies, just with one ETF. Um, literally you could have that as your whole port you portfolio and you would probably be fine. You would for, you could have that for 50 years and you'd probably be fine. Even with like no bonds or international stocks, yeah. you really probably would. So, um, and, and that, that ETF is so by the way, ETF, I know we've said this a lot in our videos, just want to reiterate exchange traded fund. It's a, it's basically a mutual fund that trades like a stock. That's what it is. You can buy it and sell it like a stock, but it's basically a mutual fund. And that VOO, which Andrew just brought up that comp that stock or that ETF has Apple, Amazon, Google, all those companies are in it. 
So it's very diversified. So sorry, anyways, I don't. Yeah, I was just wrapping yeah. it up. A little short episode. Um, don't forget to subscribe, leave a like, and a comment. If we, if you're listening um, on the audio version on iTunes or Apple, I mean iTunes or Spotify yeah. or anything like that, don't forget to uh, leave download, yeah. leave a rating. Uh, that helps us out yeah. a lot. Don't forget to use our links in the description if you're watching on YouTube. And if you're not watching on YouTube, head over there, The Stock Bros. And until next time, thanks for listening. Thanks, guys. All right, that is two down.